Today, students in Lee Summit and Hickman Mills go back to class. And in Hickman Mills, for a couple hundred four-year-olds, it's their first day of school. The district is launching a new full-day pre-K program in a brand new early learning center. Four-year-old Bria is the youngest of four, and the last child Tanessa Thomas will send to school. A little bit anxious, yeah. Um, I'm wondering if this will be my last one. I probably will have a couple of tears. She's starting at the Irvin Early Learning Center in the Hickman Mills School District. It's a brand new, renovated building only for pre-K and kindergarten students. It's very important to reach the kids at an early age because those are those building blocks, and they'll have the tools that they will need to be successful adults. And this is the first year the district is offering full day pre kindergarten to every student. A young child's brain can, can can um, soak up information so much quicker. Um, the younger they are, the more information they can retain. The district wanted to ensure every student is ready to learn when they start school. A lot of our students come to school and they're just not kindergarten ready. So Superintendent Dr. Dennis Carpenter committed $9 million for this three-phase project to focus on early learning. Now we know what each of our kindergartners will know when they enter kindergarten. Who's that? For Thomas, I'm feeling uh, very renewed uh, in the area. I'm feeling very uh, confident in the school. It's an investment in her community and her children. And Dr. Carpenter did have to make some budget cuts in other areas in order to afford this pre-K program. He said they made some personnel changes, changes to how they hire substitutes, and how much they spend on remedial classes. Dr. Carpenter said if the children start learning earlier, they won't need as much help later on in school.